another uh, reaction video. This one is the third of the weekly series that I'm doing, my top five favorite tricks of the week. So without further ado, let's get into this. Um, I'm not gonna waste too much time talking in this intro, but let's just jump right into this and uh, see what tricks we got this week. I'll just show you my favorites and I'll get my thoughts on them. So let's get into this. We actually have quite a bit more than last week. We have seven tricks this week. I'm just going to keep calling it top five every week though because that sounds good. Um, but sometimes it might have more like it did the first week. And uh, we're just going to start it off here. Um, of course, Bonza Tron has got to be in this list. Um, I feel like he hasn't been posting many tricks lately except for this like past week. Um, he posted two bangers that I thought deserved to be in here because obviously he just lands insane creative tricks. So let's check this out on the new Chrome Noyas. And uh... We're just gonna see. Let me turn this down real quick. First, I don't even know what that is. Oh, it's glitching. There we go. So he did that weird forward moon circle. Not even forward. I don't. I don't even know what that's called. What? I don't get it. I honestly don't understand. Bonzatron. Bonzatron is literally not human as everyone says literally not human like well, look at that of course he's gotta always have a like a crazy um lighthouse save and then that spike it was sketchy but you know what it was still sick even though if it's sketchy it's still super sick um next up we got k dilla kyle diller here in for the third week in a row I just hold up two when I meant to hold up three. I'm not that stupid, guys. Um, so Kyle Dillard here, um, I thought this one was super sick. He posts a lot of clips, so expect to see him in here a lot because he's just always posting. So um, look at this right here. Why is my thing glitching? I don't know why the videos are glitching. This is, this is a problem. But yeah, hopefully it's working now. So he did inward lunar to axe to quad axe flip to lunar to axe to quad axe flip to lighthouse to that flip to axe to you guessed it quad axe flip. You can... Kyle Diller just needs to get out of here. Honestly, I'm not even gonna say anything more about that. Um, I honestly forget what this trick is, but it's Wyatt Bray. I guess we're watching it not the first time for me, but. I forget what this is, so it's basically the first time. Oh, it's like a candlestick trick. I don't know why I put this in here. Actually, yes, I do know why. That was sick. Okay, so just some really tech candlestick stuff. I never, like, do stuff with candlesticks, so this is, like, really impressive to me. Um, look at that. I don't know, like, which one of those were dubs and trips and stuff like that. I'm going to watch this once again because I wasn't really paying attention. So that forward, one and a half to candlestick, I think that was dub inward, throw to lighthouse, insta back to candle, both inwards, by the way. Got to blow the string out of the way, you know? Yeah, I think these are all dubs. And then dub inward candlestick, and then dub to down spike. Are you kidding me? White slay, it literally slays. It's in his name. Of course he's gonna slay. Look at this. Okay, we don't need to watch it again. But you understand what I'm talking about. That that's crazy. Um, now I think this is the the crazy banger coming up. That's probably gonna be the title of this video. If it's not, then I'm sorry. But here it is. Yes, it is. <sighs> Guys, look at this. Like, are you kidding? There's cars out there making noise, right? When I'm about to talk about one of the sickest tricks I've seen in my life. Alright, so... I don't, honestly don't know who this is. I just started following him after I saw this clip. Because he won... I think he won Bryson Lee's contest with it. His 10k contest. But he was in that... The first top 10 hardest tricks of 2017 that I reacted to. And I think he did like 20 turntables in that. Um, didn't know he had an Instagram, but... I found it after Bryson Lee posted it, so just check this out right here. I'm not gonna talk, just watch. Are you kidding me? 
Are you actually kidding me? If you guys didn't know what that was, just look over here real quick. 31 turntable. Wait, we don't need to see that. That's the second part. But I'm going to watch this again, and I'm going to try and count these. He just did 31 turntables. Are you kidding me? This is the world record right here, guys. Take another look at this. 1, 2, 3, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. 31. Oh, I actually counted it. I thought I would lose count, but yeah. Just counted it. It is 31 turntables, so I don't know why he would lie about it, but he didn't. And he just lined at 31 turntables. Most I can do is three. Literally, three turntables. He did 10 times more than me. Nothing more to say about that. And here he is again. Uh, actually, let's give a shout out to him real quick. What's his name? Hiroto Mari? Don't know if that's his actual name, but if you guys haven't followed him, he's only at 1,500 followers, so um, everyone who's watching this, if, had, if you have Instagram, you need to go follow this, this kid. He's probably older than me, but I just oh, go follow him. Really, do it. Because we got another clip here from him. And just take a look at this. He is literally the king of turntables. I don't understand how someone can be this good. Okay, so he's just, you know, chilling in Underbird. But then, all of a sudden, he's just spinning it on Underbird. Six Underbird turntable. Like, what? That looks so sick when it's spinning. Because it's kind of like forward, because you still have to balance the Underbird, so. Oh my god. And then he's got some tap line after that. And he, yeah, he's not just good at turntables. He's pretty good at taps, too. Like, what? I was... I'm just starting to get into these, honestly. They're kind of fun, like Underbird turntables. But I'm not that good at them. Look at that. I just... Just no. Just no. So, not only did he do a 31 turntable. Just a normal turntable. He does a 6 turntable on Underbird. I've never seen that before. Um, we're gonna see bo uh, leave bonds for laughed here. Oh my goodness, I can't talk. Laughed? What am I talking about? We're gonna save bonds for last here. Um, this trick was submitted by someone, and usually if one of you guys submitted something and it wasn't like super crazy, I wouldn't put it in, but this one was actually kinda good. Um, kind of a tap line and then some juggles and stuff like that. So just check it out here. Make sure to go follow Donald Mac. Um, Pretty small on Instagram, you know what? I'm gonna follow him live on video right now, so make sure to check him out. Two posts, um, he's only at 13 followers, so um, go ma make sure to follow him. We're doing tons of shout outs in this video, but who cares? Just check this out. Um, not the craziest out of all of these, but you know, I thought it was worthy to be in here. We got that six tap at the beginning. Six tap is not an easy trick, so. Um, and then he adds on stuff at the end with like, all these juggles and late ken flips and down spikes and fast hands so yeah make sure to go check out dama mac um six tap is not an easy trick like i said my most is only five uh not to juggle the spike but five taps is my most so um hey and while we're at it with shout outs you better go follow this guy right here his name right here i'm not sure if you know who it is but you know he's got a pretty cool instagram he's close to 3,000 followers so you should probably go do that or I don't know. Just just do it. Dave Chur. I wonder who that guy is, but you should definitely go check him out. Um, last one here is another clip from Bonzatron. Slain on the Noyas again. Um, what is this clip? I forget what this is, but I thought it was cool because it's creative. So, a um, little cool thing up to Inward Lunar. And then that little cool thing using his other hand. No idea what these tricks are called, but should, this is the cool part right here. So he throws it. Pressure kind of with like... I don't know if he's using two fingers or one finger, but goes around like that, catches it, does a weird UFO back on the lunar, and then he does a lunar UFO thing, inward lunar, I mean, and then he's not done, he does a little tap, insta juggle the spike, are you kidding me, Bonds just needs to chill out, um, he's attending catch and flow this year, so expect him to uh, lay some bangers on stage, 
I'll probably be uh, up to date with that, and that'll be in my December news. Just, I want to watch this one more time, because look at this. I don't get it. This part is so cool. I was trying this trick, and it was actually harder than I thought. It didn't look hard at first, but then I tried it, and it was kind of hard, so. I thought that one was uh, super cool. Make sure to check out Bonds. I mean, why wouldn't you check out Bonds, and who isn't following Bonds, but yeah. Tons of shoutouts in this video. Make sure to follow all the people I talked about. And, you know, this guy up here is pretty cool. Um, but, yeah, that's going to do it for this week's uh, Kendama Tricks of the Week, I guess. Um, and I just want to say something. These tricks are completely my opinion. So, don't take these as, like, the actual five best tricks of the week. They're just my fa five favorite. Um, so, if you think something should be in here, don't get super mad about it. But it's just my opinion. So... Um, yeah, that's gonna do it for this video. If you guys did like it, make sure to leave a like, make sure to subscribe, oh, and make sure to, um, if you have a clip that you think is worthy to be in here, you can, uh, just send it to me on Instagram, and I'll put it in if I like it, and yeah, make sure to like this video, make sure to subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.